Farmers battling rising prices and a labor shortage. We've been talking about that all day. Now turning to autonomous tractors to help them get the job done. All thanks to the CEO of a California robotics company. Let's bring in the leader of that company, Bear Flag Robotics founder and CEO, Egino Cafiero. Good to see you, Egino. Uh, how do these tractors work? David, it's awesome to be here. Thank you so Thank much you. for having me. So. Bear Flag Robotics builds autonomous technology for farm tractors. So we take existing tractors and we can source these from farmers, from dealerships, doesn't matter. We put our technology on them and deploy them to growers to help them with their operation. Now, can, can one operator, uh, one robot operator, command several vehicles at the same time? Oh, you betcha. That's the whole point. That's what we do from anywhere in the world. And how many workers, I mean, there was a time when we worried about uh, things like this displacing workers. Now that we have such a labor shortage, uh, are, is there concern that, that you may be pushing labor out for good from some of these jobs? No, not at all, David. And, th and that's the thing we talk about a lot, right? There's this misconception about agriculture, right, where if someone leaves or, or quits their job, there's this you know, long line of, of qualified workers just ready to go to fill in. That, that couldn't be further from the truth. You know, Folks who know how to operate machinery safely, know the operation, are dependable, are just super hard to find. And so the, the folks that already exist on these farms are some of the most valuable members um, of that staff. And what we do with our, with our technology is help those, help those folks be more productive at their jobs. Now, there are also, of course, the family farms. There are a lot of family farms still left. I mean, uh, let's face it, the corporations are, are, are trying to take over, but there are still some family farms. Are they in the market for this technology? Because this would allow them to be, be able to expand their operations, right? Oh, ab absolutely. You know, we're building technology that can be used on every farm in the world, and, and we're exceedingly excited about that. You know, the tractor is ubiquitous across farming. And so when we deploy technology that helps that tractor be used more often, 24 hours a day, um, you know, in tighter weather windows, that helps everybody that uses tractors. Now, mechanical things always break down at some point, and, and the more stuff you have yeah. in a mechanical object, the more likelihood something will break. Uh, what is, how would you rate your tractors, the autonomous tractors, from, uh, from the ones that are driven by human beings uh, on, on the site there? I mean, is it, is it, are there more things that could break down with the autonomous units? Well, I mean, we build reliability into our systems. This is the value prop of Bear Flag, right? You can farm more, you know, with fewer acres on less land. That's, that's what we do. And so reliability is built into everything we do. We have, you know, one of the, you know, the finest engineering team in the world building this technology. And we have the finest ag professionals in the world deploying it to growers to increase, increase their efficiency and productivity. That's what we do. That's, that's what makes us good at what we do. And you stick with the customers to provide them with the support they, they need, right? Oh, yes, sir. I mean, that's that's absolutely right. You know, um, growers have so many things going on. They have to look at the weather. They have to look at market prices. Right. They have to look at disease crop. Um, we, we just help them make that part of their operation easier and more dependable. Well, now more than ever, with a labor shortage, a lot of farmers having to destroy some of their produce because they just don't have the workers to pick it up. Now with these autonomous systems, uh, you provide an answer for them. Thank you so much for being here, Gino. Best of luck to you. Appreciate it. David, thank you so much. Take care. Absolutely. You too.